Yo people, what's good? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy. We thank God for the day. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing blessed. As you can see, I'm at Marshall Land Rover and Jaguar in Newbury because today is car collection day, people. Today is car collection day. Will you see the car that I got? Will you not see the car that I got? None of you would have seen it coming. I promise you. I've asked some of you um, what car do you think I'm going to be getting? And none of you guessed the car. None of you guessed the car. No one guessed the color. Nothing. No one guessed the make. Nothing. They got some crazy stock over here. They got some F types, uh, Range Rover SVRs, all kind of stuff, man. So I'll show you some of that. But yeah, man, car collection day, people. Let's get it. So right here, you got a Range Rover SVR. You no know, quad exhaust, as you can see, 16 plate. A lot of people love these cars, but they're not that great on fuel. You got um, F pace here. And then I think these are like some, this is an eye pace. Like, this is like electric variants. That looks all right, even though it's a wagon. All black, I don't mind that. It's a bit long, but ooh, cream interior. Yeah, this isn't bad. This is not bad, people. Black wheels, I don't mind that. I don't mind that, I don't mind that. I think this right here is a, ooh, forget that. Is that an F-Type? That's an F-Type coupe. I'm sure that's an F-Type coupe. Oh yeah, F-Type coupe. V6, but it's not an R though, because the R has a V8. This is a V6. This isn't bad in the silver as well. This is not bad at all. I don't really like the back on these. I feel like they're a bit weird. But I have some more stock inside, so I'm gonna go inside now and show you what other stuff they have in there. Oof, I'm getting excited because it's nearly that time. It's nearly that time. As you come in, you can see it's a nice place to be. Social distancing, guys, come on, that's important. But you see a nice little silver on black F pace here. That looks nice. I think this is around 63K or 64K, around about. I'm not sure what plate this is, probably like a 21 plate, but these are nice. These are nice. Then you got some, this is like a smaller version, but this is what I'm talking about, people. So this is the F Type R Coupe, I believe. I think it's a V8 version. Look at that, man. 21 plate, as you can see. That's nice, man. That is nice, isn't it? That is nice. Oof. 63, what? So for the same price as an F pace, you can get this. For the same price. Yeah. I don't know if I'll fit inside this though, but I'll definitely squeeze. I don't know if you guys can see that, but nah, this is nice. I wonder why they've done that then. I wonder why this has one big exhaust rather than the, the two little exhausts that we saw outside. Over this side, you've got the Land Rovers or Range Rovers, whatever you want to call them. So you've got a Range Rover here. A lot of people like Range Rovers, you know, and like Land Rovers like that. A lot of people like Defenders, but they don't really do anything for me, you know? I don't know. They don't really do anything for me. And the cost quite a lot, like this right here, these go wild, like so many people want. Land Rover Defender, I'm not sure what variant this is. I think it's a V8, because it has the quad exhaust there. As you can see, it's got the quad exhaust. Let's see how much this one costs. So this one, this one costs 99K, what? Wow. Wow, I don't know why, and it's only two doors, so it's a coupe version. But that's the inside anyway, as you can see. The inside does look nice though, I'm not gonna lie. It's got the nice little Alcantara or suede. It's got the Alcantara suede on the steering wheel as well. So it is quite premium, it's quite premium inside. Let me show you, that's the back there. So it's not, it's not terrible, but 99K? I don't know, man, I don't know. And they got some more models here, but my car is right over there, as you can see in the handover bay there. They're taking care of me. My light's do it in the car, covered. <laughs> got some stuff up in there. Look at that. Got a nice little keychain. Ooh. This is my new baby right here. None of you would have seen this car, I promise you, man. All right, guys, I'm gonna stop teasing now. I'm gonna stop teasing. I'm just, I'm gas the car face. First and foremost, we thank God, so thank you, God. But yeah, man, oh, man. First car, you know. It's real, it's real. It's really, really real. Sheesh. Man like Stuart, obviously, right. boss with the deals. Yeah. This is the guy, so if you guys want a Jaguar or a Range Rover or any other car, because you do like different cars, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do yeah, man. brands as well, so non-brand, but yeah, come yeah. see me, definitely. Yeah. yeah. All right, three, two, 
one, five. Beautiful, right? Alright guys, just to take you through the car quickly, this is the 18 plate as you can see. So it has Mercedes um, newest, I believe, gearbox system, which is the nine speed or nine G Tronic automatic gearbox. So you know it just allows for smoother coasting whilst driving, you know, like on motorways and whatnot. Um, it allows the car to sit in higher gears with lower revs, you know, so less noise and more comfort basically. We've got the brilliant blue paint from Mercedes. This is actually an additional option. I think it was around like 600 plus, I don't know. But um, yeah, so they don't do this color no more. So, hey, limited edition right here. It has Mercedes night pack, so all this here is blacked out. Usually, it would be in like a chrome color. Also, you can see the Mercedes is blacked out as well. LED updated headlights as well. As you can see, it has one line for the C-Class. Um, the E-Class, they get two lines, and the S-Class, they get three lines. You got the upgraded 19-inch AMG alloys right there. They're puffing. They are puffing. Look at that. Whew. Look at the side of the car. Again, this car has night pack. So right here, it's all black. All here as well. It's all in black. The normal version, it's all silver around there. Look at that paint though. I'm not sure if this is coming out on camera, but look at, this paint is absolutely popping. This is the back here. Wow. As you can see again, because of the night pack, all here is all in black as well. C220D, it's a diesel. That's the key, guys. Lovely. So, guys, if we step inside now, why is my seatbelt moving? Huh? Why are you moving like that, big man? <laughs> so, you got the nice article leather by Mercedes. You got the ashwood or the oak finish there rather than the gloss black in the center console, just so that you know you don't see scratches and stuff as much. Um, my seatbelt out here moving, crazy, crazy. Got a nice little clock there. You got the um, AMG Sport steering wheel, Mercedes, well, for this year anyway, 2018. This is a premium place to be in. Obviously, no one's fitting in the back, but it's a coupe. No one needs to be in the back. Guys, this, this is lovely. This is lovely. Obviously, because it's a coupe, so it's got the frameless window, as you can see as well. This is lovely. Also, you got heated seats here as well. I was really looking for the memory foam seats, but for the price point, it just wasn't in my budget. Um, neither was a sunroof as well, so this car has no sunroof, but it's all right, it's all right. We've got air conditioning. Um, you got, for the mirrors here, stuff for the mirrors. The car's not on right now, so, and I think this is for the boot. Yeah, man. Show you the boot real quick. So that's the boot space. Not too bad. Got some space in there. I think you've got a little flap here for your shopping. And I think if you push these, then the back seats come down. So it's not too bad. So guys, when you get a new car, it's imperative that you have essentials, you know what I'm saying? We've got some antibacterial wax, as you can see there. You know, car's got a small nice at all times, so we've got some spray. Probably put that there. Microfiber towel, you know, to clean any dirt and stuff. And tissues, tissues are essential, man. Ah, oh, guys, you don't know how excited I am, man. What? That's me, you know. What? We thank God, man, we thank God. It is a blessing. Ah, oh, man, I don't know what to say. Just look at that, man. Ah. Oh. I still need to figure out a name, so drop in the comments some names. I feel like Blaze. I feel like Blaze goes well, you know, with the blue and the cream, Blaze and our little satin. I'm gonna close out the video here. Um, thank God, thank, thank God. Ah, uh, I'm like, I can't even do the video properly, so I'm sorry if this video was all over the place. I was just too, too gassed, man. I just keep on looking back at it, but anyway, so we thank God. Um, make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell so you don't miss um, any new uploads. But yeah, man, the boy is gone. Yo, guys, good morning, what's good? So it's Monday morning now. 
my car's getting delivered today. If you watch my video, then you know. I can't again. C-Class Coupe. I told you, none of you would have seen it coming, man. Because most of you probably think that I've got a Range Rover or a Land Rover because obviously posted a little snippet on my um, Instagram just to fill you lot off the scent, you know what I mean? Then obviously on the video itself, it had the Land Rover cover. I'm not sure what time it's going to come. I'm just anxious. I'm waiting. I'm, so, I'm still gassed, man. So, yeah, man. Also, sorry if I'm looking a bit mad. I haven't even gone downstairs to you know, wash my face, brush my teeth, anything like that. So, if I'm looking a bit crazy, hey, it is what it is. I'm just too, too happy right now. My room's looking a bit nuts, but hey, such is life. But uh, yeah, man, I'm just, yo, your boy is out here. Come on, man, no limit. But anyway, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yo people, what's good? So the driver just called me now to say that he's about to drop off the car that he just you know stopped for like a little coffee break or whatever. So so happy. As you guys saw, the car is lame. Um we thank God so so Lord, thank you so much, man, because it's such a blessing. But yeah, now thank you for all the love, man. Even though a lot of people have already said congratulations to me. And like I said, when the YouTube channel grows and we're hitting you know, big views and we're getting sponsorships. I've got you lot. You know, from you lot that were rocking with me, from my people, them to people I don't even know that have been rocking with me. I've got you. I've got you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, people, the car is here in all its glory. And even in the rain, yeah, it just looks supreme. Got the nice little wheels there. AMG 19 inch wheels. Ah, it's actually here now, you know. This is a blessing still, man. This is a blessing. Look at that, man. Look at the nice blacked out spoiler, like I mentioned before. There's a couple stuff that I forgot to mention because I was so gassed on collection day. Tinted glass. Nah, it's a proper car, man. It's a proper car, as you can see. All right, bring it around the back. Tinted glass again. Look at that Mercedes emblem, C220D, diesel. Do you know what I mean? Again, it's got night packets, so all down here is in black. People, come on, man. Let me know in the comments if I did good, man. Let me know in the comments if I did good. Bam. Look at that, man. Come down this way. Let's open the door. Sheesh. Sorry, it does not look premium inside here. Hey, don't mind this. Obviously, you got to keep your car fresh for the gear, then. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> But look at the interior, man. They made these seats specifically for the cube so you know you're more comfortable, you have a more um, sporty kind of experience. Obviously, you got the AMG floor mats. Look at that clock there, man. It's premium inside here. It's premium. I love it. So people were inside the car, man. Ah, oh, feels great, man. <sighs> look at this as well. The seatbelt comes up. So wait, let me try to lock the car. I'm trying to show you guys. It's not working. I don't know why. Maybe, maybe I might have to start the car. Wait, hold on. If I lock the car. Oh, so that one's gone back in. Is this one going to go back in? Maybe not. If I... Oh, okay, so if I lock the car, it goes back in as you saw. I didn't lock the car, but then if I unlock the car. Is it? But there's a button here. So obviously, like, maybe if the car's on, and if I press that, it'll come and go back. I oh, don't know. These seats, man. Pen. Mm. Maybe I should like a car ASMR. You know? Actually, guys, yeah, that's a, that's a thought, you know? Let me know in the comments if I should do like a car ASMR. So like, you know, going through like the little bits. You know when you hear like, who's running? But like, you know when you hear, I don't know, like, I don't know if you heard that. Or like stuff like, <laughs> I don't know if that's even, or like, you know when you hear clicks like this. I don't know if you can even hear that. I just look stupid right now. But anyway, let me know if you think I should do like a car ASMR type of thing. And I'll try and make that happen, man. I'll try and make that happen. That would be kind of sick, actually. But thank God, man. This is like the biggest blessing, man. First car as well. I know some of you are probably wondering like, what? Like, insurance must be through the roof. But I promise you, it wasn't. It was actually really, like, reasonable. Um, and I'm not that old. <laughs> I'm not that old. I'll probably put out like a video on like um, insurance and stuff like that and um, how I got the car as well. Obviously finance. Shout out to Charles and Dean Finance. Come on. Oh, oh, oh! Chill out, man. The alarm just went off. Can you imagine? 
<laughs> that loud just went off. Hey, that's a good thing though. But anyway, what was I saying? Oh yeah, Charles and Dean Finance. Shout out to them, man. Specifically Mike from Charles and Dean. Big up him. I'll plug his stuff, obviously, down below. So if you guys are looking to finance a car, whether it's a car like this, unless... No, 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 no. Don't... Fam, stay unlocked, man. Okay, so... Should be all right now. I don't want neighbors coming out thinking, what's going on here? If you're looking to finance a car, whether it's a car like this, big or small or whatever, yeah, man, shout out them. Mike is very, very helpful. Um, and like the, everyone there is just very helpful, man. So they should be able to help you, man. But yeah. Hey, you know what? I can't wait to pull up on the man them. I pull up on the man them and my sisters. Hey, man, it's going to be real. It's going to be real. Hey, there's a couple people, yeah. I don't know when they see this car, they're gonna go crazy, especially Auntie AJ. What when I pull up on AJ, yeah, and she see this, she's gonna just go ballistic, fam. She's a nutcase, man. She's probably gonna faint or something. She's gonna be like, Oh, can I drive it? Come on, I'm your auntie. I'm like, Hell no, what do you mean, man? I need to go through this car, man. I need to go through this car. I need to live with it. I need to set things up. You know what I'm saying? I need to, I need to make sure it's proper. Obviously, got my little cloth here because you know. I think I'm gonna close this door a little bit. It's not properly closed. Just, you know, don't want the rain messing up the interior. <laughs> Thank you so much. If you've got to this part of the video, I appreciate you. Like I said, yo, we're growing together. Do you know what I mean? I don't know why I paused like that, but I did. <laughs> Anyone who's watching this, Yo, if you have dreams, if you have aspirations, whatever you have fam, push yourself, you know? Obviously, a big part of my life is good. Um, not everyone, might have faith or believe in God, but that's that's what's helped me. Trusting yourself, no matter how hard your situation is, no matter what um, things are coming against you, no matter what people may say or or try to push in your face. Hey, if you if you got a vision, yeah, go get that vision, man. Make it into reality. You know what I'm saying? And that's just where it is, man. So push yourself, believe in yourself through hard times, through tough times, through great times. For those people that do have faith and that do believe in God, you already know, man, put your belief in God, trust in God, and he'll come through for you, man. There's countless Bible verses that talk about it, that mention it, that talk about having faith, that talk about being focused and trusting in the Lord. Um, yeah, yeah. <sighs> Guys, life is good right now. Whew. Hey, don't forget to like, comment, share, like, comment, share. <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification button so you don't miss another video. And your boy is gone.